I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am far Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I stopped at Salvation Army. I had to think for a second and Goodwill. And then I also got to go um, look through this lady's garage that I went to her cell last weekend and then she invited me to come look through her garage so I got some good stuff. So I thought I would just show it in a video. I'll start off with Goodwill. Um, I tried a new Goodwill. Like I'd never been to it. It's not that far away from me. But I, had, I didn't even know it existed. It was really tiny. And I'm like, oh, I found the worst Goodwill. Anyways, I did find two things, but I was kind of reaching with these, so we'll see. So they're, they are Victoria's Secret, like, vintage gold label. And some of these can do really well. So I did get them. This one was $3.29. And it's just this um blue patterned, you know, kind of nightgown. And it may do better on Depop. Not interested, sure. I did see some nice sales on Posh with gold label. So I'm not sure about these particular ones, but we'll see. This other one was $3.99 as well. I don't think I paid that much. $3.99 and $3.29. Um, they did ring up right, so. I don't know, I spent seven dollars. That doesn't sound like $3.99 and $3.99, but and then so this one is the same. It's a gold label, a Victoria's Secret vintage. This one's probably bigger. It's a medium. The other one is a small. And it has like a little bit of lace. So it may go for a little more because it has like that lace detail. And it's just like a different color. It's like a till color with pattern and then lace at the bottom. Great, great vintage shape. So you'll see how they do. Hopefully they do really well. I didn't find a lot of Sal at Salvation Army, but I did find some good stuff. These were $7.99, my first time finding Spanx and they're just the denim. I looked it up and I, I knew the style and I looked it up. Now I've forgotten, but it's like the faux denim, like kind of legging top. They have pockets in the back, and I did pay $7.99, but I think comps look like 40 ish so that's good. Okay, next I did find a pair of On Clouds, and they are kind of worn, but they don't have any holes in the back heel. There's um, some loose threads I'll need to trim right there, and they need a good washing, but $8.99 I'll take them if there are no holes or anything. There are some wear like on the bottom soles, but you know. $8.99, I'm sure I can make a profit because all the clouds are so nice. And then lastly, first time finding Allen Edmonds. I don't know if you can see that. They were $13.99, but they're, um, they're like Oxfords. I don't know what they're worth yet. I'm trying to see the size. I'm not sure. We'll figure it out but they are in good shape they've been worn a little bit you can tell by the heel but terrible not terrible I'm sure they're worth $13.99 so now I'll start with the shoes that I got from the lady I got everything for $200 so these are Kelsey dagger which I think is sometimes sold at anthropology I don't know if it always is but it's like these knee-high suede booties with a heel they're really cute obviously not the right season so i'll sit on these a little bit i'm sure but i'm fine with that they're in great shape like, you can see a few wear marks but really not bad so i got those next i got a pair of jimmy Choo um kind of heels with a pointed toe um they do have sounds of wear so i do need to clean them up a little bit before i list them but that is fun. They're says 38. I don't know what these are worth, but we will see. Hopefully they're worth a good amount. Okay, now I'm just gonna pull from the bag of clothing. First thing I found are new tags Bren Walker um pants. I think they're linen maybe. Nope, cotton and elastane. I was wrong. 
So they're just this black pair of pants. They have a side zipper and they're new. So I'm not sure. I don't think I've sold Bryn Walker before. I have found it, but I never actually got around to taking pictures and listing the item. So it's in my death pile, but I'm sure these are worth it. Because I've heard um, Bryn Walker sells pretty well. Okay, next I got a pair of VS Pink size small joggers that have velvet on the side and then they're just black and then the logo is kind of embroidered i think that's really cute and not too much wear on them which is nice because vs pink sometimes has a lot of piling but not that next i found this and this is probably for me i think it would look really cute with a denim jacket but it's just made well and it um has a little graphic and i think it's linen so this would be really nice for work for me. Yep, 100% linen, which is nice. And it's like new condition. It's really good condition. Next, I found this Disney Chaser. New with tags. Little baseball tee. And it just has um, Frozen on it. And it says Be Brave, Be You. I just thought this was super cute, and I know somebody wants this. Um, and I looked online and I wasn't finding this exact shirt. I will have to dig a little deeper. But it may be kind of hard to find. It did retail for $79. So we will see. Really cute. Next up on this new with tags J. Crew dress. Um, it's a size zero. So kind of a harder size to sell, but it's this I think it's black. It's like blackish gray um, dress and then it has ruffles at the bottom and I think it has some wool in it. Let me look again. Yep, 100% wool is the um, content of the dress which is really nice. So I think this will sell well, especially being new. Okay, next pair of pants. Eileen Fisher, let's see what they're made out of, organic cotton, polyester, and spandex. So just a pair of black Eileen Fisher pants, I know these will do really well on eBay, so I got those. Okay, next, <clears throat> I actually didn't know that Buy Anthropology had its own line, like I didn't know Anthropology had its own line until now because um, I got that sweater a few weeks ago by Anthropology, but um, I didn't know they had their own lawn, so now I know. This is brand new with tags, retailed for $138. Wow, that's crazy. But it's just like this kind of button-up jacket with this little graphic, or not graphic, but just these pattern details. Um, it's really cute. And it's brand new, so we'll see what it goes for. I know some anthropology is really hard to sell, but hopefully it being new tags will help it. And it's part linen, so that will help it too. Okay, next was a brand I had never heard of. And it's Lola Australia. I mean, it actually retails for like $300. Don't think it has a size though, so I will have to measure it unless the size is down here. Never mind, the size is down here. It's a medium and it's 100% cotton and it's just this like navy blue and white kind of popover dress. I'm not sure the style yet, but I'm not sure what it will go for. So I know that will do well. And then I also got this Eileen Fisher. Pretty sure it's linen, the content tag is removed, but just kind of beaded tank top. And then I got this Tadashi collection, medium size um, blouse. So it's got like some sequins. Um, comps actually look really good for this brand. I haven't found this exact top yet or looked for it, but I will look it up again. Okay, next I got this. What is this? I don't remember this. <laughs> Okay, it's soft surroundings. Tag's falling off a little bit, but that's okay. 
it's like this lightweight kind of um, cardigan with raw edges. Normally any of their like toppers do really well. So I got that. And then I got this Rachel Roy dress. I haven't looked it up. But it's just this gray kind of professional looking dress with a v-neck. Kind of a bodycon. And then the back has a little split. Um, and it's 96% wool. So I think it will do well. That's a nice fabric. Okay. And just two things left. So I got these Kalia leggings. Um, they're kind of like a paisley print. They're in great shape. They're kind of like an ombre. So, got those. Oh, and then lastly, this was cool. It's RTA. Which I forget. I think it was sold on Revolve. And it has pretty good comps. So it's like a... I don't know. It's hard to tell. It's like a short sleeve blouse with a little cutout. Super cute. I will have to find a stock photo because I know pictures won't be great of this. But I did find it already, which was great. So that is everything that I got. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day.